Hey, who's this? How y'all doing today? I was just thinking what I wanted to eat today. So we gonna do some seafood. Uh, well, it's not a lot of seafood, just the shrimp. We're gonna do a shrimp bar in the oven. So y'all ready? Let's get it. Let's do it. Y'all ready? My oven is on 400. We're gonna mix this stuff up and then I'll tell you how long to cook it and when to add the shrimps. So, uh, I think I have everything. Y'all ready? Come on, let me bend you down. Okay, y'all, y'all see my pan here. Maybe I need to bend this down a little bit more. There you go. I have my pan, I have some olive oil, I have salt, pepper, I have some Old Bay seasoning, and I have some garlic um, powder, and then I have some minced garlic, y'all. I'm trying to use this up because I really don't use it. It was bought for the first time. I don't want it. I love my fresh garlic. However, I'm going to use this up in here. Uh, we're going to be using some butter and uh, some lemon. So first and foremost, let's get the stuff in the pan. Let me give me a spatula out because I'm going to need to stir this as well as I get it in. Well, I can probably do a spoon, huh? Y'all ready? I'm ready. Y'all ready? We're going to pour in. We're going to put this corn in here. We got fresh corn, y'all. I cut them in three and four pieces. We're going to get those corn pieces in here. We're going to get these sausages in here. And this is some jalapeno beef sausages, y'all. Let's get that in. We're going to get in these potatoes. I have yellow and white potatoes. We're going to get those in here as well. We got more potatoes than anything. Y'all know I love potatoes, don't y'all? Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to cut this lemon. Because I want the juice of this lemon, y'all. I'm going to squeeze lemon juice. All over. Oh, that's a lot of juice in here, y'all. Y'all see all y'all got to do is roll it. Oh, that's going to be good. All right. Let me wash my hands. Okay. Next, y'all, we're going to add in some Old Bay. All over, y'all. Don't be shy. And then when we get ready to put the shrimp in, we're going to also put El Obey on those shrimp as well, y'all. We're going to do a little salt. I say for the salt, well, with the Old Bay, two tablespoons. Well, a tablespoon and a half. With the salt, y'all, maybe a half a teaspoon. We don't like all this salt, y'all. We're going to come in, you know, with my tablespoon of black pepper because you know that's what I like. Then I'm going to come in. I got so over here. I have some, uh, a half of a yellow, red bell pepper, and a half of a small onion here. We are also going to get those sprinkled over in this because that's what I want. Don't necessarily call for it, but, you know, I wanted to see some color in here, and I'm going to do it like I do. 
Mm-hmm. Ooh, child, that already look good, don't it? Mm-hmm. Baby. And then I'm going to come in with my minced garlic. Let me grab a spoon. And we're just going to do this, y'all. I don't want no big old spoons. But I don't really like this minced garlic. Give me my fresh garlic all day, every day. I think that's enough, y'all. It sure is strong. Yeah, I think that's enough, y'all. Let me wash my hands again. It sure does smell good, y'all. Then we're going to get our olive oil. We're going to sprinkle olive oil on here. We're going to give it a stir. Then we'll place our butter. Let me get this butter off this hot stove. Let's give it a good stir. Let's get, you know, incorporated. Get it moved around a little bit. I want the potatoes kind of. Oh, that's. Oh, I wish y'all can smell this. Oh, we didn't even put the garlic powder on here yet, y'all. Bad. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's gonna be some good. I want to sprinkle my garlic powder. You know I can't get enough of garlic, y'all. We're gonna let that cook just like that. We're gonna take this butter. We're just going to lay it on top. So I'm pretty much going to use this old stick of butter. Look what that look like, y'all. See it? Mm -mm -mm. What we're going to do now, we're going to cover this pan, and we're going to let it cook for 30 minutes. Then we'll come back and add the shrimp. Well, I think I'm running out of oil paper. It's more than enough, that's for sure. Hey, 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 hey. Let's give that a cover. I'm going to poke a couple of holes. Not many. I'll just let it breathe a little bit. We're going to stick these in the oven for 30 minutes and we shall return. Okay, Hustas, we back. This has been baking now. Um, I actually took it out at 30 30 minutes if my potatoes wasn't um, soft enough so I put them in for 10 more minutes they are almost there so let me add the shrimp because we're going to cook the shrimp for 20 minutes and at that time these um, uh, potatoes ought to be just the way you want them so let's get the shrimp in here y'all I'm putting the shrimp in with the shell on okay 
They've already been washed. So we put them in Easy Peel and Devein. We're going to put these in and then I'm going to sprinkle in some Old Bay on these as well. I'm just going to put them all kind of ways, y'all. They pretty big too, ain't they? Ooh, child, I'm so ready for this. You know, when I go get my shrimp, y'all, I get about three or four pounds, and then I come home and I wash them up, and then, you know, to each pound is 20 to 21 shrimp, and so what I do is I break it all down, and I always have more shrimp than uh, the pounds that I ask for, y'all, so I end up having three and a half, uh, well, if I get two pounds, I end up with three pounds, if I get three pounds, I end up with four pounds, and that I got two pounds and I ended up with three pounds of shrimp, y'all. So let me wash my hands and then we're going to come back and get the seasoning on top of those shrimp. And I have a lemon on the side, y'all. Once it's done all the way, we're going to also, I mean, we're going to also uh, squeeze some lemon. So, y'all, let's put some Old Bay on these uh, shrimp on each and every one of them. Don't be shy. You know, Old Bay and seafood just go together, you know. Ooh, baby. All right, y'all. We got those seasoned. I don't know why I'm wanting to put some basil on top of these. Y'all want to add basil? Why the hell not? Let's do it. Let me find my basil, y'all. You know, I want flavor. Let's add some basil. And I'm just going to sprinkle this, you know, just so it can be seen. Uh, yeah, I want some basil on here on these. Ooh, yeah, that's gonna be good. So this is about maybe a tablespoon, y'all. That's it. Let's get this covered back with the foil paper, and we'll put this back in the oven for twenty minutes. I'll be back. Ooh, y'all, look at that. I'm going to be squeezing my, my lemon juice. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, I want this. I'm, I'm so ready. I'm so ready for this. I saw a couple of seeds. Look at them shrimp, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. Look at this. We're going to now sprinkle some parsley on that, y'all. Let it look pretty. We're going to be eating this too, y'all. So y'all see me. Y'all see a video of me eating it. Ooh, this looks so good. My goodness. Honey, let me bring you a close-up of this good, good stuff. Here, baby. Look at that. Ooh, honey. Ooh, I'm going to let it cool down, y'all. And then I'm definitely going to give me something to eat. So stay tuned, honey, for the mukbang. Bye, babies.